Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is an HP touchpad running Google Android 4.1. I'm about to actually roll it back to a version of Android 4.0, and the reason for that is that a developer that goes by the name of Dora Gary has uh, figured out how to get the camera to work with Android. So when you're running WebOS, the software that comes with this, um, you can go ahead and use the camera to your heart's content. But on Android, up until now, nobody's really figured out how to get the camera working. And now you can do that using Signage in Mod 9 which is a version of Android 4.0. So uh, in order to do that, you go to the Roots Wiki forum, you use the download link for the latest preview build, and that will let you uh, boot into Cyanogen Mod 9 with the uh, camera working partially. There are still some problems. You can basically take pictures, you can preview pictures, you can't use Skype or third-party apps. You can just use the built-in camera, and the camera actually might stop working once you exit the app. So it's a little bit buggy, um, but let's go ahead and take a look and see how it works. First thing you need to do is go ahead and download it, which I've already done here, and then we're going to reboot into recovery. This is all assuming you're coming from a previous build of Android for this device. If you're using uh, WebOS and you've never installed Android, you can find instructions for doing that at lilliputing.com. But if you already have installed Android and you've got TeamWin Recovery Project or Clockwork Mod, you can then use that to install an update here. So are we in the right directory? We are not. There we go. Actually, yeah, that should be fine. We're going to wipe our cache. And actually, if I was doing this right, I probably would have done a factory reset first. As it is, just to be on the safe side, I'm going to go ahead and do a factory reset now. We should write, wipe our uh, data partition. And then uh, let's go ahead and reboot. This is clearly the most exciting part of the video. Here we go.
and you can see we've got the camera app right here on the home screen. So at this point we don't have our uh, Google Apps installed because I didn't do that from Twerp, but I just wanted to get a quick look at the camera. So we're going to launch the camera app, and you can see me sideways, sort of. So one of the known issues with this device right now is that you sort of get this uh, inverted sideways preview. Um, the picture should actually come out properly, it's just that it looks funny at this point. So let's go ahead and take a picture. And take another picture. And one more for good measure. So after you actually snap a picture, it looks like this does come out right way up. Uh, it looks a little distorted, but it does work. So let's take a look at the gallery, and you can see the pictures. These are not the most flattering pictures I've ever taken of myself, but the lighting's not very good, and uh, you can see that it does work. So this is sort of just the first step. Uh, ultimately, what we're hoping is that uh, we'll be able to get this working with Skype and other third-party applications. It's only got a front-facing camera, the HP Touchpad does. Uh, there's no rear camera, so you can't really use this as a you know, to take photographs on the street unless you held it up and didn't look at it while you were taking the pictures. Um, but for video chat, it's going to be pretty exciting. Right now, early stages, we've got these glitches where um, once you launch the app and exit it, you can't get back in unless you reboot the system. And in fact, I think I might just crash the system. And you do wind up with... Um, Okay, so we're not crashed entirely, but if we want to get back into the camera, all we can do at this point is reboot the system. You do have to deal with the sideways and distorted preview pictures, but it's still uh, it's still kind of exciting to see that the camera is working on Android at all on the HP Touchpad because it's been well over a year since the HP Touchpad is released. It's been uh, uh, around a year, I think, since people started working on porting Google Android to run on it. And this is the first time that we've seen the camera working at all. So this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing and a quick look at the working camera on CyanogenMod 9 on the HP touchpad.